kicked off here at VPW 173 with the owner of VPW. show them with the big bufa desmond cole welcome to vpw 173 before the storm my name is willie thrill and i'm joined by jem martell jem we have a huge contract signing right here right now with the king of new york tournament winner desmond cole it is intense hear that crowd they are going wild for the new king of new york he's bringing the energy he's got that shiny shiny crown on top of his head and i can only imagine that that is what he wants to keep he is owning the king of new york he wants to continue to be the king of new york and there's no better way to continue to be the king of new york than to come out and challenge for the new york state championship of course held by dante drago Desmond Cole, a former VPW New York State Champion of his own, looking to regain that title. He looks like he's ready for anything tonight. Oh, yes. You know what I had to do to get there? 
versus Dante Grego. I didn't win this for no reason. I won this so I could get back what's rightfully mine, and that is the New York State Championship. He's been walking around here calling himself the real team in New York, the New York State Champion. Well, hold it as tight as you can, because when the pants are destroyed, Desmond Cole making it official. Eager, eager, eager. He wants to get that. And I think the crowd wants the same thing. That's right, they want. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your New York State champion, Dante Drago. This crowd certainly wants to see this man dethroned. Dante Drago is the best. He's not making his way out here. No, is he going to no show this contract signing? Your New York State champion, Dante is getting impatient. Right, making the crowd anticipate the arrival of Dante Drago is the best, our New York State champion, but he might be milking this a bit too much. When that happens, people with those egos, they like their time in the sun. Wait a minute, what's this? Members of Delta House, Jack Tomlinson, Nick Robles. I what they've got to say. He's got a mic in his hand and he's clearly got a message. Now, we 
probably noticed there's a third of us that's saying that B does it area. It's the best! And again, like I said, I have this whole spiel as to why Dante is not here, but I think, judging by the fact that I just came out here to the wrong music, not my new leading man music, should just show you the kind of show that is being run around here, and a show like that is being run around here, Dante Draco does not need to waste his time, especially if their time is being spent on you. So I didn't allow my friend Dante Drago is best to be here because Dante's got a friend in me. Dante's got a friend in me. You go to C E T E L T E L.
serenading Jack Tomlinson. He won't be at ringside for this match. We got the big boof of Desmond Cole versus the rocker boy, Nick Robles. Things certainly took an unexpected turn to get this show rolling today. I've got this championship sitting right in front of me on the commentary table. The gold is beautiful. The number one contender for the New York City Championship is the first. Sponsored by Joe Gilgano, the rocker boy, Nick Robles. Desmond Cole putting his King of New York crown on the line. Jim, what do you think about this? I, like I said, I'm flabbergasted. Didn't expect it. There's the bell, and we are off to some intense action right away. Desmond Cole wants to keep that crown. That's right. A few rights and a little shimmy for you. Sending the rocker boy reeling. Huge kick to the head. And the big boofers are on a roll right now. He is, if he can keep this going, this is going to be a really short match. That's right. Well, that's the oh, confidence dive. oozing out of Desmond Cole. Suicide dive. He means business. And you gotta love it. You gotta love the charisma on this guy. This guy is as confident as they come, as cunning as they come. Absolutely, and he has got the rocker boy just absolutely floundering. What's he got planned next? Oh, he's got the ref. Oh, man. Using ref Nick to distract the big boofa. That is some down low stuff right there. Even nice. right in the beginning of the match, not out of desperation, just to do it. I mean, I expect nothing less out of the rocker boy, Nick Robles. These guys have an attitude to them. All these members of Delta House, as we saw just before that contract signing. We got to figure out what's going on with Dante Drago. Is he going to make it to our main event later tonight against the Even Stevens? And, and yeah, I, I, did he get stuck in traffic or... Who knows where he's at right now, but Jack Thomason definitely in the back making the call while his buddy out here, Nick Robles, has to get this done on his own. And he is taking a nice suplex to Desmond Cole. I gotta say, while Nick Robles wasn't too keen on participating in this match, if he wins, he gets the King of New York crown, which gives him a number one contendership to that New York State Championship, maybe keeping it in the house, the Delta House. That is Delta House's plan, but do you really think he's going to live up to this? You know, he, like you said, he seemed like he didn't want to participate. He was reeling in the beginning of this match, although he seems to have gained his focus now. He got a couple of pins in. He's gotten some good shots, but watch out. Here comes Desmond Cole. Desmond Cole is one of the most resilient wrestlers I've seen on the independents. It's going to take a lot to keep the big boofa down. Oh, he misses that line there. Oh, sunset. They kick out at two there. Look for a backslide. Oh, fighting for it, fighting for it. Not going to get it. Oh, my goodness. Here's the cover. That could have been it. But Desmond Cole, like you said, is a resilient wrestler. All right, Nick Robles here does have the size advantage, though. Expect to see a lot of power moves from the rocker boy here tonight. He seems to be pandering to the trap count crowd, trying to get them to lend him their power. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if pandering is the word I would use. He's definitely egging them on. <laughs> <laughs> the rocker boy here, strutting his stuff. Couple rights. Oh, he's rubbing that elbow in. Right on the back of the head of the big Bufa. Kick to the gut. As you mentioned before, Delta House, they got a lot of issues going on. We saw Jack Tomlinson with the Victory Pro Wrestling Championship. That, of course, happened because Dante and his crew stole the championship from Bryce Donovan at our last show, DPW 172. Jack Tomlinson walking out here, but unfortunately for him, had to hand it back to the owner of VPW, and hopefully he can get into the hands of the real champion, Bryce Donovan. Oh. Huge 
slam from Nick Robles. Here's the cover. Two and a half men right at the last minute kicking out. The Rocker Boy is getting very confident that this match is his. That's right. And you like to see this side, I guess, out of the Rocker Boy, depending on what side of the fence you stand on, because he's doing it on his own. He's proving himself right now that he doesn't necessarily need Delta House around him. He can more than handle his own against the big Bufa right now in that ring. Absolutely, and there he goes again, taunting the crowd, as you say. But anybody that's going to dress like that, they've got an ego. They really, truly, deep down, they want the crowd to like them, even though they might not show it. That's right. He was trying to get a Bufa chair. Go for that cherry bomb there. Misses. Nope. Desmond Cole looking for something big. Oh, nobody home. up on the top turn buckle. This is high stakes. What's going to happen? It's always a dangerous position when two wrestlers are up there. Popping up on the and second rope. Whatever he's got in his mind, he's determined to get it, but Desmond says no. Desmond Cole! Oh, beautiful! Coming off the ceiling, it looked like. <laughs> Absolutely. That was incredible. That impact took it out of both competitors. They are down. Nick Shin is counting. An even matchup, as you said. Who's going to get up? Who's going to fight through this? Who's going to come out of this with the King of New York crown? Both men. Oh, Desmond Cole coming in with the fire. Leg sweep. Slam for you. Oh, yeah. Kicks it back up there. You see all of his breakdance experience gives him that agility. There you go. Bam. Leg drop. Oh, yeah. Kicks out. Kicks out at two. And you don't see that too often from that leg drop. That's a Whoa. signature of big goofas. I thought we were done. Oh, if you know Bufa, you know what's next. He's oh. got the thumb pointed up. Oh, what a counter from the wow. Rocker Boy. I've never seen anything like that before. Oh, huge kick. Hell of a kick there. Yeah, I'm up top. Oh, this is vicious. Oh, this is classic Bufa right here. Oh, Rocker Boy barely hanging on there. Oh, oh kick to the face. Didn't expect that one. And another big boot. Huge boot and well scouted by Nick Robles. He knows that Desmond Cole likes that combination in the corner. Here's a cherry bomb. Oh, there it is. Oh, man. Right at the three. Didn't quite get it. We almost saw a rocker boy as our king of New York. I was nervous there for a moment, I must admit. What do you think a rocker boy would be like as the king of New York? You know, I think he would take it and run with it. It, it might it might bode ill for everyone, especially with Delta House behind him. Right. I'm personally a hip-hop guy, so I'm rooting for Bufa to hold on to this crown. I mean, I, I'm a fan of all music, <laughs> but, uh, I, you know, it, I got to go for Bufa on this one just because everything that he's put in, you know, everything that he went for at the last show, it's definitely a crowd favorite here. We know what the crowd wants. Oh. He's looking for a stomp there, but Desmond Cole catching him. Powerball oh. in the corner. Huge oh. kick. Another hell of a kick brutal. by Bufa. Absolutely brutal. And here we go. Here it is. Catch him in the corner. Oh. Falling down. Yes. The There's no way he can get up from that. How about a little cherry on top? Oh, Goes yes! Up. Must come down! And that's all she wrote. Jim, I'm right with you. I like all music, but this guy just has to have the King of New York crown around his head. Absolutely. It just feels right. It looks like it was made for him. I mean, let's be let's be real. It looks perfect up there, that gold. It's better than 
a belt for him, if you ask me. That's right, that old school mentality, and you know what? He could have a belt in his sights. The Rocker Boy is down. He is one step closer to that match with Dante Drago for the VPW New York State Championship. reminder for you. That's the killer kicker. That's the fearless flipper. That's Desmond Cole. That's right. 